Hey. Hi, everyone. This is Sarah. This is Alfred. Welcome back to Dead Space. And welcome back to me. Uh, Show it. Just hold it up. I, I have a controller now. Yes. He let me have a controller. Well, I I, uh, I was playing Dead Space 2 myself because, as I mentioned... Uh, oh, what? I don't know the controls. Yes. Alfred, please. See, you got him. Here, give me this. Normally you're supposed to jack that thing into the controller, but I had to jack it into this by the looks of it since we got a splitter. Okay, how's that? There we go. Okay. Well, you can hear it now, can't you? Yes. All right, so while you're aiming, A is reload. That's stasis. Okay. Sorry, that's kinesis, that's stasis. Okay, what is flip? Uh, RB. Okay. And I know that she was holding a PS4 controller, but she knows these better. So I just have to translate in my brain. All right, and then... Unaim and hit uh, reload, I think. How about unaim and square? Or X? There we go. And that's heal. Oh, nice, okay. Um, and then what is LB? Uh, sprint. And then holding right stick can is we, breadcrumbs. Can we make pressing down the left stick run? Uh, no, I tried. Mm. It's rather unfortunate. Can we turn the sensitivity up? Uh, that we should be able to do. Anyway, yes, I was playing Dead Space 2 earlier today because, as I mentioned, uh, I think it should just be mouse sensitivity. And then go to the bottom, hit accept. Balls. Okay, and then... I, I won't let me get there. Can you just... Did it, did it go? Yeah. Okay, cool. I was playing Dead Space 2 earlier today. And I realized, hey, the keyboard controls actually do kind of suck. Because in a game like Half-Life, all you have is... Yes, stall them, please. In a game like Half-Life, all you have is primary aim and secondary... Sorry. Uh, you have primary fire and secondary fire. Why do I feel like it gets faster the more I go? There's probably acceleration on it. Got it. To help you see. So hit the shop. Um, We've got goodies to sell. Um, but yeah, the way that this game handles its like keyboard controls is kind of weird. We're selling. We're selling that gold semiconductor at the top. All right. Okay. And if you like, you can sell another round of plasma energy, but you don't have to. Hmm. Is my inventory going to get bigger anytime soon? Yes, it will. Your inventory gets bigger over the course of the game. Oh, shoot. I meant to buy nodes. Uh, you got 10k? What I was going to say... Uh, Alfred wanted me to learn how to use the PC um, controls before I went back to controller. And I'm actually super thankful um, that he did because... He was right, and they are pretty good for some things. Yeah, so um, the the thing that I was thinking about, Sarah's going to play Half-Life 2 at some point. Um, and playing Half-Life with a controller is painful. It feels bad, and I don't like it. Where is... Hold right stick for your breadcrumbs. I know, I'm looking... Uh, is there a bench anywhere, you know? Uh, no. No? There might be, but I don't know. Yeah, so pardon the, the small um, adjustment that's going to be made while I get used to a controller again. Um, honestly, Alfred's like, Alfred holds up the controller before we come in here to record. And I'm like, Alfred, that's cheating. <laughs> it's cheating. We said I would play with the controls. I, where am I going? I don't know, breadcrumbs. Right here. It's supposed to be here. Wow, we uh, stopped right before the end of the chapter. Oh. 
Sorry, guys. Well, last time I, I was, was like, scared. hey, you're coming up on the end of the chapter. And and you were, and you were then you got spooked and you were like, I got to quit, though. All right, save your progress. Yeah, I think I have a, a spook meter that New save slot. It's like Dark Souls, yeah. It's like the meter's going up. Oh, no. I usually get an anger meter. Like, <laughs> I, um, I've learned to tell myself when I get too angry to just take a fucking break, you know? Yep. There, there's no sense of, um... Isaac, come in. Kendra's right. The ADS is completely shot. I'll can we turn it up? Fix this. Kendra, if you can hear me, see if you can get into the ship's reports. It sounds like you have better access from there. Thank when you, man in the chair. Tell us about the artifact, Hammond. This marker. I don't know anything there we about go. that. It's referenced in the captain's record. They brought Perfect. it up from Thank the you. Mm -hmm. It's on the ship? In cargo. They think it's of alien origin, but I don't know what the hell it is. Really? CEC didn't know anything about it. You don't have one yet. You just got to listen to them flap. Back off. I am not the bad guy here. We're all shaky right now. You're going to have to trust that I don't know anything about it. We've entered the debris field. Get to the captain's nest. I'll explain everything later. Come on down. All right. So, going to try to use the Ripper War this time? Attention! The bridge of the USG Ishimura is a secure location. All personnel must pass a security bioscan before entering. Please proceed to the right and wait for instructions from the officer. Thanks for your cooperation. I never like to hear that. Like, yeah. No, it's the monster. Oh, you hear my heart rate? Yeah. There's something really funny. Can I? I don't remember. In Dead Space 2, Isaac can get scared, even though the player isn't. Like, I think that's just... That's probably just telling me that there's going to be things popping out of the wall. There's going to be a worm man as well. Or worman, if you prefer. Oh, you see that texture coming through? Oh, yeah. Interesting, huh? Yeah. I like how... Um, I, don't, I don't know if this... This might be intentional, maybe. Uh, yeah, maybe it's supposed I to look like tell. polarized glass. I kind of... Oh, found my punch. Yep, it's the same input. Where's my stomp? Right, Pete. Right. There you go. Okay. Um, same shit, different controllers. I almost want to turn up my sensitivity more. What do you think? <laughs> rock with this and Just get rock in the fight. Rock with this, and then what's my... There you go. Don't need that. So yeah, I would love to hear from you guys whether I play better with a computer or a controller or if it's more entertaining to watch me play uh, with one or the other. Um, obviously, I'm so involved when I play that I don't just don't know. Yeah. So. Isaac, impact on the bridge right at your feet. I'm reading heavy damage, but containment looks solid. Life support is stabilized. We've got to get the ADS working. ADS, which was for aim down sights. Hello? Bridge, come in. We've been boarded. Repeat, the ship has been boarded. We are under attack. Open fire. How are they? they? They've already killed most of the deck. Oh, wow. Look at yeah. all this debris. Yeah. ADS actually probably either means asteroid defense system or anti debris system. But, uh. Save station. Uh, Alfred, obviously, I would love to hear what you think compared to the controller, because I notoriously have an issue with not. Back to the first one. Not. Thank you. Not looking at the thing I need to be looking at. Um. Probably mention it. I just have a bad attention span, so sometimes the thing that I'm supposed to be looking at. Just isn't what I'm doing. Yeah. Um. Uh, are you comfortable? Yes. Good. Just making sure. Well, there's this thing that we've had to do where your elbow is pushing into the fat of my arm. See what that is? Schematic. Mother. All right. Nope. Other pause. Other pause. There we go. Interesting. Uh, LB. LB. Okay, let's go and sell something. Okay. Actually, no. Let's pop that health pack. Uh, right now? No. Let's Got not. It. 
No, don't do it. Don't sell. Don't use the health pack. Okay. Level three suit will suits refill your health whenever you get a new one. Okay, what shall I do, my dear? Go back uh, up drop to the... the single plasma energy you have. Why don't I just go up and sell? Because it'll take longer because you have to go back to the shop to get the level three suit. Well, no, there was a shop really close, wasn't there? I suppose. Whatever you want to do, just remember how to sprint. I suppose you could also try dragging it with Kinesis. Do you think you're going to try to use the Ripper Blade more? No. <laughs> Sorry. I don't think so. Do you think I should? I think so. I might try then. It does a shitload of damage. And it feels very good. Uh, where do I find the store? Uh... I mean, it's been a straight line so far. I think you can just start walking. Okay. Back the way you came. Hurry, fill space. <laughs> See, it's right here. Don't worry. The less I talk, the less I have to edit. All right, uh, sell like, yeah, sell a plasma energy stack. Sell like a stasis pack, maybe. And then run back and get the suit. One thing that I did notice when I'm editing is like, and I, I imagine I'm probably gonna leave this this in when I edit, but like sometimes it just fucking kills me to like cut out conversations that are really fun, but like they're not relevant to Dead Space. I don't know. They're just I, for you. They're just for you. I guess it's an indicator that like, hey, if uh, I decide to post the unedited stuff, uh, go back and watch it. So go back to the store now? Uh, yeah, we can at least drop this off, if not buy it. But if you remember, this is now past the part where I was too scared to play as a kid. So you don't remember? So I don't know. Oh, you don't know? Yeah. I, well, how old are you? Were you, what, 13? I think so. When did this come out? 20... This came out in 2008, but I actually played this after Dead Space 2, I think. Um, after Dead Space 2 has come out. So I have to buy it now? Yeah. Okay, makes sense. Level 3 suit unlocked. Let's take a look at the price. 20000 I don't have that. And unfortunately, we just got rid of some stuff. But start saving for it and don't buy a power node. Okay. Sorry, you'll be a lot happier with a level 3 suit I because will. it increases your armor and inventory space. Okay. So there's no way I can upgrade my suit before what is inevitably the next boss? Look, if you get your ass whooped, we can just come back here and start selling ammo. You're right. As long as you save. Um. What was I gonna say? But, uh, Alfred, I would really, uh, like your opinion on how I play with a controller versus how I play with the PC. Um, maybe the answer will surprise me. Maybe it'll be what I think and that I just play better with a controller. It might be. Um, um I, I, I'm gonna stick by my guns and I am gonna make you play Half-Life 2 with keyboard controls. Oh, you, you think so? You think they play, um... Yes, I think, I think playing Half-Life 2 with, a uh, controller is dumb. Well, I I support that. I believe you. Isaac, damn, he's getting me. The place is making me jumpy. Fucking asteroids coming through the roof. Look, I know Kendra doesn't trust me, but I don't know anything about a marker or anything else. This is supposed to be a repair mission. Can I? Probably not. If you look at him and hit RB, uh huh, it'll probably tell you. Fix these boards. The main power routing is shot. You're gonna have to reroute them through at least three junction boxes. Jesus. Primary cannon. Oh, but first, you need to yeah, activate okay. the atrium elevators from bridge security. He's protected. You can use them to get to the junction boxes. Hmm. By the way, Isaac, be careful. I saw something out there. I don't know what. I only got a glimpse. It was big. Look at me. I'm just like in constant uh, flight or fight. Like, look at my posture compared to. Yeah. What's his name? Uh, Hammond. Hammond. 
Don't worry, I only just started remembering it myself. Ooh, ooh I the hope captain's. he's nice. Huh? What? Captain's chair. Captain's chair? What's in here? Text log. Mining log. Dallas A. Uh, supervisor, second engineer. Death toll is mounting. Known dead so far. Uh, a lot of people. I bet this is some of the. A lot. Yeah, crew. I bet that this is the staff. Oh my god, <laughs> that is a lot of people. That's like eighty people. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, at least like forty. All right, so now we have our objective, having stopped off with Mr. Hammond. Shit. Stand back. Stand back. I that one was dead when I sealed the pod. These things don't die easily. What was that? Nagamorph. It looked like it had a human face. A lot of them do. Mm, yeah. You I guess, remember aliens? Yeah, the babies. Wait, did I? What? Did I want to come up here? Yeah. Okay, cool. Use your breadcrumbs. I can't while I'm on a platform. Hmm. I didn't remember that. Du, du, du. So, um. I don't know if I should tell you this. Don't. Don't do it. Okay. It's not a twist, but it's just... It's a clever thing that they did. Hello? Ah! What did you think was gonna happen? Sarah, you watched a door get punched in and then you walked more towards it. Okay. What's heal again? Uh, square? Oh, a bullfight. You know it. There you go, you got it. What was it? I suppose you can't answer while you're fighting. Sorry, what'd you say? I was asking what the heal prompt was. Uh, square. Okay, good. Okay, how... Can I get him to crash into something, maybe? Yeah, most likely. Uh, pff, oh, fuck. Um, what's... Okay. What is the grenade that you can throw with the line gun? Um, it's RB. While aiming. I'm out of juice. Out of juice? Health. Health. Up you have. Pardon? You asked for help. What do you want? I'm out of health. You're out of health. That's the only med pack you had. I don't think... Was that from me? Was what from? The... I, I was trying to throw a grenade. You don't have the line gun, dear. It's not in your oh, hands. Oh, God. <laughs> that would be why. Down? This is not great. So you don't, I don't know if you have to get him to charge into things. I think you can just get him to start running and then sidestep. You've also got a thing that can slow him down. Uh, what button was that again? Uh, I want to say aim and circle. There he is. Hang it. Triangle. Sorry. Whoops. That's my fault. I don't remember the button. Growing pains. Okay, Sarah, you really did just walk towards a door that was getting beaten on from the other side. And you saw it and you kept walking towards it. I, um... I didn't know what was going on, to be honest. But what could possibly have happened? I thought there was an ast asteroid. I don't know. Okay, go towards it and let's watch. The door of good things. Aim in square. There we go. Wow, he's still pretty fast. I think this thing is called the Brute. Um, I need more stasis juice. 
Um, I think you get two shots of it at least. But remember that you can also sidestep him once he gets running. Oh, you got a piece of him off. Hmm. What's happening, babe? Okay, he's got his charge going. Sorry, I, I just am so disused. You, you know what'll check him good? I was gonna say Ripper. We might have one stasis uh, pack if you wanna pop it now. Just aim and hit the stasis button twice. But I would aim and... I would aim at him. There we go. Now, don't get tagged because he can still fight. All right, get the Ripper out. Shoot. <sighs> Much better on the second time. My hands are so sweaty right now. <laughs> Is the terror gripping you? I don't you? know what you're supposed to do. <sighs> Can I try? Hyperhidrosis. Yeah, why don't you tell him about it? Uh, I'd rather not. Even while I'm focusing? No. No, thank you. Right, guess I'm talking. Real brick to the face. Yeah, he is. And the stomach. And the head. Wow. Oof. Did you hear me heal? Did you heal? Yeah, it was when I was dead. Pretty hard, right? Yeah. We'll get him. <laughs> okay, good move. What the hell? Okay. <laughs> now it went off. Hey, see, Resident Evil has a big, obvious, like, red thing on the back. You yeah, know? well, with with Dead Space, you don't get that. You get um. Okay, so he turtles up. Maybe it's like a you need to do it three times type of thing. Probably. He rocked your shit. Yeah, he did. Okay. Awesome. Ripper! Really good. Ripper Chan, man. It's the best. Okay, next time. Next time what? Next time I'll beat the boss. <laughs> That's okay. Uh, do not use or reload your line gun. So it was a damage thing, because I was confused. I was like, he's going to another stage, he's turtling up. What am I doing? Uh, yeah, it looks like you just gotta loop him through it. Do not use my what you said? Don't use your line gun, it's empty. But you can put some uh, nodes into its uh, into its thing. Uh, I'd rather not. I kinda wanna stick with the plasma gun. I mean, I can give this back to you. Cool. So, um, well, I mean, it's it's just like in Resident Evil. When you upgrade uh, a weapon's capacity, it gets refilled. And the line gun is empty right now. So, let's take a look here. Hmm. That level 3 suit, ah. we are 24k away from it. Um. Oh, 
Jeez, that, that's so what, sensitive. What are you doing? <laughs> Switch to the D-pad. What do you mean? To go up and down? Sure. So what are you thinking, babe? Why are you hovering mm. over the line gun? Let's take a break. Okay. <sighs> All right, we're back. Yes. We did our shop talk off screen. Yes. Right, and then use the mouse to click back in. All Great. right. Um, so if you want, you can sell... No! Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. My entire body tense up. No! Uh, if you like, you can sell an order of ripper rounds as well to get you a little further instead of selling plasma cutter. I was hoping I could sell maybe some of the line racks. Line racks are really rare. You think so? Oh, I know so. Okay. Line racks are some of the rarest ammo in the game. If that tells you anything. We made it. Level um, three suit. Level three suit? I know I'm looking. Okay. It's up. <laughs> I see. Uh, I think you were hovering near it. All right. Now, fortunately, this will refill your health, or it should. It doesn't dead space too. You ready for this thing? Mm-hmm. Ooh, I have even more, like, thingies on me. Yeah, it's like a uh, brigandine, or what people think brigandine is. What the hell? Oh. That's really annoying. Oh, well. Mm -hmm. The more armor will help you. Let's take a look at your inventory. One second. Eh? Eh, save it. Okay. Because if we need to, we can just come back here and buy one. But if you're on low health, then you should, then stuff will drop for you. All right. So do you want me to look at my inventory in here or? Uh, no, in the actual thing. Sure. Back out, get away from the thing, and then hit the inventory button. All right, so I got a small med pack, stasis pack. Um, I got some plasma rounds. But line look at cutter. your actual inventory space. <gasps> you. So all that, you just get more. Alfred, I'm so excited. I know, right? Ah! Isn't it useful? Because now we've run into two or three problems where your inventory was full. And granted, that's normally not like a real problem in survival horror. It's one of those like suffering su from success, like first world problems. But like. Look, it's been a problem. Okay, quick question. Yes. Do you feel like I'm faster when I use the computer, or was I just slower because I wasn't healed right? Isaac, make us whole again. Shut up, blonde lady. Um, I don't know. I feel like it would definitely... Because I just wanted you to switch over to controller because I realized that, like, it's a little clunky. On your left? No, no. A knob! And before you. Yeah, take that, original Xbox. <laughs> Oh, Sarah just found out that the Xbox 360 isn't the original one. Yeah, it so... It was just this weird gap in her knowledge where, like... Oh, is that bug back up? My, um... My... I had an Atari. I had an N64. I had an Xbox 360. I had a... Sorry, I had a PS2. I'm trying to go in order. PS2. Um... Then you got a GameCube? Yeah, there was a GameCube at some point, And then I had 360, Xbox One, and PS4. And the switch. Uh, uh, if you upgrade the line gun's capacity, it should refill of ammo. But we can, if you don't want to do that, we can just look at how much it'll take. We can look at how much it takes. You can just put one node in and it'll refill capacity. I trust you. Ring-a-ding-ding. The line gun is good for when you're backed up into a corner and there's just a wide range of limbs in front of you. Yeah, I, it's one of those things where I, you know, obviously you want to... You know, when you play a lot of video games, you get into a new video game and you want to play a certain way. 
Um, oh, if you want to put health up, now would be a good time. Rig health? Rig? And then two duds and... What's rig? Armor. Armor. So you put two duds and then you get HP. Why not start here? Oh, I can because I can already got it. Yeah. Right on. Yeah. I'm sorry, what was I saying? Uh, you were talking about um, the way that you like to play. And then if you want to just save these nodes uh, for any doors we come across, that's fine. You could also try to push the plasma cutter a little further. You were talking about how you want to play a certain way and how you do really like the plasma cutter. Uh, so, you know. Um, I don't think I'm a stubborn person, but sometimes I... That's what fills your health. Now look at you, look. Nice. Hell yeah. So that's why that's why I said, like, health upgrades are worth the three nodes that it takes to get. Because you uh, get that. Isn't that great? Yeah. That feels good. Um... Yeah, what I was going to say is I don't think I'm a stubborn person, but obviously, like, if a certain way of playing works for me, I'm, uh, maybe it's not obvious, but, um, what am I trying to say? This is mutiny. You'll all be tried for mutiny. The kind. Make them listen to reason. Settle down, then. Simmer down. By maritime law, you can push the elevator button oh. if you like. <laughs> I hereby declare Captain Benjamin Matthias unfit for duty. The mark <laughs> must be delivered duty. to the church. Terence, please. I'm sorry, Ben, but I can't let you do this. Take him back out in the stomp. Heretic. Hold his head. Murderer. Hold him. Was there a quicker way to do that, man? They were probably trying to inject him with something, but it just ended up in his eye because no, it was an accident. Dead Space has an uh, obsession with eyeballs. <sighs> That's awful for you. Yeah. It is awful for me. I barely made it through Dead Space 2. Um, what I was trying to say. Ways that you like to play. I, you know, there's certain ways I like to play, and I get caught up in... Oh, I should do this because in Resident Evil you're supposed to do this. But it really serves you well to kind of like listen to people who've played the game before and not always think that. Um... I don't know. Trust the opinions of people who've played the game before you. And like, even if they're wrong and like that's not the style you want to play in, at least you learned what you don't like. Yeah. Um, I mean, because it serves you no good just to get caught up in your ways, because then, you know, you don't learn. And Yeah. Um, so, and, and Sarah mentions this because she recently made a complete turnaround and is totally fine. Oh, yeah. Is totally fine with playing this game just with the plasma cutter now. Because originally she was like, no, I'm going to need more weapons. Absolutely not. She, she literally says, not in my current state, absolutely not. But now, like, and I was like, ah, okay, but the plasma cutter's yeah! really good. Get out of here! Sorry. Great shot. Bad shot. So, how's those damage upgrades doing for That's you? That's pretty good. You use the same amount of ammo that you would have if uh, you hadn't upgraded that thing, but also you missed a shot. So you can now do those in two. One for each limb. Uh, what was I going to say? Talking about your use of the uh, plasma cutter? Yeah, because, like, obviously I can be like, oh, I don't feel like that's going to work, but, you know, it's good to just kind like, like of, like, try things when it comes to styles function. of video gaming. Keep an eye um, kind of distortion effect coming from the floor. It could be dangerous. Because I, I feel like a lot of um, video game veterans can be kind of... How should I say this? Stubborn. Stubborn. And I try to prevent myself from doing that because that's not really fun for the people you're playing with. So, I don't know if you heard what Kendra said. She said, watch for gravity abnormalities. <laughs> that's fun. And in case you weren't listening... Can they, I just step around you. it? Yeah, you can walk around it. And in fact, you have to. Good. 
If you like, you can just drag uh, the ammo it dropped over to you with Kinesis as well. I'm sorry? With Kinesis, you can pull the ammo it dropped to you. Um... That's a different one, you know. Oh, sorry. I thought those ones dropped ammo too. Uh, you did, but I think you picked it up when you walked by them. Uh, I'm sorry, where was I? We were just talking about um, gamers who get set in their ways, video game veterans who are like, this is the way to play. Well, I mean, games, Watch are, the games are for fun. Yeah. And, I mean, I've been a, I've, I've done it too. I'm like, this is the one game. But, like, dude, if someone's having fun, let them, let them learn. Let them be bad for a little bit. Let them be bad for the entire time. Who cares? Yeah. Oh, shit me. Uh, uh, A. A? A. Which one's A on a PS4 controller? I don't know anymore. It's X. Listen to your muscle memory. Aw, oh, fuck you. You have enough. Oh, you? Good. Oh, there he goes. One more. One more. One more. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry, my friends. The hell is he doing? There we go. Um. You're getting a lot of line rack ammo if you're uh, interested in trying some more of that. Sure. As well as ripper blades. Uh. Down on the D-pad for line gun and left on the D-pad for ripper. So anyway, um, I think you should really only. I mean, you should encourage people to play a way that's gonna grant them more success, but... Um, You're full on stasis. If they're having fun, then... Just let it go, man. Let people enjoy things. <laughs> I don't know what made me so uh, upset about that recently. Um... I'm trying to think. Oh, I know what it was. One of our friends kind of gets bullied sometimes because he's like really sweet. And, uh... Make some distance and turn and shoot. Ah, he's back. What is he, a regular enemy now? Yeah, that's just a brute. They're just regular enemies now. This was a bad idea. Or was it? Can I get in here? Oh. What? Will he not come over here? He's, uh... Either his AI's locked up or he's scared. That was stasis. That was stasis? Yeah. Okay, so triangle doesn't do anything, by the way. Uh, it's inventory. Hello? Mr. Monster? I'm here to put There he is. Uh, uh. Good. And you can get the limbs. So, actually, you mentioned how this game doesn't do the big, giant, obvious... Switch the Ripper! Left on the D-pad! Uh, uh, uh. Rip him! Yeah! It's just like using the knife on a downed enemy. Sorry. That's fine. The second one was a little greedy, but you did good. Might might do you well to heal. I don't have heal. You, you picked one up. There you go, see? Thank you, Alfred. Up on the D-pad. Switch black to the cutter. You're good. Sorry! Swear to reload it. Or no. some The, the reload button, which is not square. A. It's A. Okay. Little chickeny right here. Sorry. That's okay. I, uh, for those of you who have played Dead Space 2, I just got to the area where you have to fight a bunch of, um... Stasis? Yeah, good, good. Aim a little up. Wow. Great job. Thank you. So, line gun, right? Lango was good, but that was a whole clip of line gun ammo as opposed to one ripper blade. Yeah. So the ripper, use it like the knife, you know? Mm -hmm. Like an enemy is stunned, get in there. Hey, a partner, nice. That is great. That's great, in fact. Uh, you can probably stasis that, which is what all the stasis refills mm -hmm. are for. And then walk past it carefully. Uh, uh, uh. That's okay. You got a little more time than you think. Did I do it? Yep. 
Fantastic. I'm making some progress with the tracking grid. Thank you for believing in me. Keep moving. In the very first episode, we I tell you to pick normal mode, and you're like, you have a lot of faith in me. I'm like, I know you can do it. I don't know if I said that then, but that's the truth. I know that she can do it. Thank you, Alfred. Naturally. Um, but yeah, one of my friends kind of gets bullied for like. This is Robert. Robert, we love you. Everything. Say it too. Online. And. Sarah, say it too. What? Robert, oh, we, we love, love you. you. We love you. <laughs> uh, he beat Metroid Dread. Robert is the biggest Metroid fan I know. Uh, and he blew through Metroid Dread in like a day or two, and then went back and then blew through it again in another day. Um, cause like Metroid games aren't actually long. I think people think they are because they get stuck in Metroid games, but. I'm sorry. I, I, I keep pressing that button. I know it's kind of annoying. I, uh, can't really, s uh, I'm having trouble seeing the blue line for some actually, reason. Actually turn around and pop the stasis refill. Oh, sure, sure, sure. Just in case you need it. But I interrupted you. Sorry. That's fine. Hey, bootlicker. Hold on. Ah. Oh, hit the right stick. Hey, bootlickers, this is the only thin blue line that matters. All right, my joke's over. Can you tell he's been playing other worlds recently? <laughs> Don't! Don't step in that! Do I have to fight him again? Uh, no, your stasis is empty, which means he's probably dead. Okay, that's... Pop your inventory open, triangle. You've got two nodes again, so yeah, he's dead. Okay, thank goodness. <laughs> what the hell was I doing? You're just walking back. Oh, goodies. Goodies. Um. Robert gets bullied, okay? He gets, he gets fucking bullied for everything. People are like, oh, bad taste in blank. Or like, uh... One of our friends back in high school was, like, constantly on him for, like, playing games badly. And, like, first of all, he's great at video games. Yeah. Second of all, everyone has their thing. You know, if you're a video gamer, everyone has their thing. Third of all, who cares? Yeah. Who cares? It's a game. Have fun. Yeah. Did it perfectly forwards, but backwards you entered into some problems. Um, anyway, so my man's blows through Metroid Dread in like a day or two, and then and blows like, through it again because like awesome. fuck, Metroid that, Dread's great. That's not an easy game either. Yeah, Metroid's kind of hard. Um, I would say that Fusion and Dread are harder than most of them as well. I mean, the Prime Trilogy is. Yeah! Get him. You notice how one shot is enough for any limb now on almost everything? I think the Necromorphs with the weird model, like, green skin um, will take more shots, but that's just because they're naturally tougher. My apologies. You're still full from the last time we got one of those. I know. I'm panicking. Sorry. All right. Open the door and be ready to shoot. Hello. Good. Thanks. Let me pause it, actually. Okay. I want to turn our sound down a little bit. Sound? This one? Why? Uh, I think I'm... I, I just want to make sure that I'm not getting talked over. Oh, sure, sure, sure. All right, as you will. Anyway, so... Ro what? Are we... Are we are yeah, we, we're good. We're go okay, cool. Sorry. <laughs> we wanted to fix the audio. Um, I didn't pause that. They heard all that. Oh. Okay, cool. I did. I just did it live. It was a small fix. I just turned the, uh, the game down. Oh, that uh, looks good. Game sound down. You a know, you've become really, really good at, um, you know, just doing your audio well. I know it's like it does not look easy, so. It's really not. Yeah. Same point. I think you've caught on it to. A, I think you've caught on it a, a lot faster than I ever would. I don't um, know. You're pretty astute. I'm gonna tell you the thing because I think it's cool. This game has chapters with names, all right? Mm-hmm. Every, and three does this as well, and some of the DLCs do too. Every first letter of every chapter spells out a message. <gasps> oh, cool. Yeah, no, I would never would have gotten that, so. Yeah. 
I mean, maybe. I, I do really like um, puzzles and riddles and stuff, but something yeah. so obscure, probably not. Um, yeah, that's how you could tell this was like a, a, a project of passion for a lot de of people. Definitely, definitely. There's so much Little clever stuff like in that. here. I mean, um, that's how I... I've been going so back and forth on Cry of Fear. I know this is random, but the amount of passion they put in it kind of... It's endearing. It's endearing. And, like, while I think it's clunky and clunky in not good ways, like how Silent 2 is clunky in good ways. Yeah, the thing about Silent Hill 2 is that it totally nails the vibe of, like, I'm a schlub who doesn't know how to fight trying to survive in a town full of monsters. Sure. Uh, and, like, James sucks. He's supposed to. Sorry. Don't panic. Right. Thank you. Good, great. Sounds like you've got some more incomings. Great. Not great. Good, good. So with these guys, don't overshoot them, don't undershoot them. What does that mean? Uh, a couple of times you've shot over their heads or under their uh, arms. Sure. Turn around, get the ripper out. Get it, and then walk towards him. There you go. Perfect, perfect, yes! That's proper ripper use. Thanks. That's how you do it. Just gonna refill my guns. And do it quickly, quickly, quickly. What the hell? Hey, hey. I was on base. <laughs> That's out. That's out. Sorry. Ugh. Sir, I'll be with you in just a moment. Let me reload this. When you reload the line gun in Dead Space 2, it makes a very good... Oh, that's not what I wanted. Oh, wow. he's He's got a stance, man. Yeah. Those things are freaks. Where do they get all the spine no from? No bullying on the Ishimura. Ow. Arby? Yeah. Yeah. You're doing great. Yeah, there you go. See? One ammo, no damage taken. That's proper Ripper use, right? That That is a textbook use of the Ripper. Um, when the Ripper is a little more upgraded, or uh, in two, when there's a lot of enemies with low health, you can go through like five or six of them with one Ripper blade. And like, that is astounding. The fact that you can get one piece of ammo and go through six guys with it is really, really good. You know, you could just kinese them. Oh, he's stuck. There we go. I guess he can't. You can try throwing him too. But they might How have do put I do a that little again? RT. Alright. Oh, 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 come on. Oh. Okay, guys. Alfred. <laughs> Just saw the little piece <laughs> off. There we go. He's down. He's down. <laughs> that's worth it. So one thing that's... You oh. just heal. Yeah. I, they do actually clean up the controls a little bit, but I do think that you just used a medium med pack. <sighs> I gotta learn to forgive myself. Yeah. That's okay. Breadcrumbs. Where are we going? There we go. You smell nice. I think it's you. No, it's you. It might also be the candle you've lit. Possible. Hey, guys. How do you like his new beard? Oh, yeah. Sarah, because she's a huge, huge super simp, cut my hair like Dante from the Devil May Cry series, specifically Devil May Cry 5, and then lied and said, no, it wasn't like DMC Dante. It was... I just did it because lots of people have that. She says that like it's a real thing that you would ex expect people to know. It looks really good. Really handsome. Mm -hmm. Look at that. And the hair, and the... You're just so pretty. This way. Thank you, person who did that with their last dying breath. Would you trust a sign drawn in blood? Uh... Fuck yeah, it worked for me every single time in a video game. 
Safe station. Sorry, I'm just looking for any. So, uh, the reason that I keep going every time that we see a save is because two, three, four are right there. Yeah. And we can actually see the names of the chapters there. Oh, that's what you were... I thought you were just trying to make sure I uh, could go back if I needed to. Uh, I, I am. Hey, everyone. Brains behind the muscle. That's him. I might cry. That really scared me. Anyway, that's why I keep doing that. Because you can even see... Oh, 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 I see. The order of the, uh... The order of the, the like, names uh, on it. okay. No. Breadcrumbs. Hold on, but look. If you would get away from the door, it might close. There we go. Right on. Thanks. I appreciate that. Mm -hmm. And if you'll look to your left... A bench. Our good friend Bench. Thank you, Bench Coon. Bench Coon. Yeah, Ripper Chan and Bench Coon. So Did I get damage already? Dam so no, you haven't upgraded the Ripper at all. We just got it. So Ripper damage starts at eight, right? Which is not very good. It's less than the plasma cutter. But because it's spinning constantly, it keeps doing that damage over and over and over again. It's like how when you use the knife and you like draw a line through the enemy's body parts, you can hit like three or four like damage spots in them and it like quadruples the damage. Do I have to go back up and use one to go up? No. These things are, these three are filled, they stay filled. Okay. If you want to go anywhere else, I'm you gonna, just need to put a note in. I'm just going to hold off on uh, upgrading right now. Okay. Um,. I will say that if you decide to upgrade the Ripper, you will be very happy with it. Because its damage is already the best in your arsenal. And upgrading its damage is multiplicative because you get that new big damage proc every single time it hits. And it hits, like, several times a second. Sure. So remember, you got the Ripper out. Do you, do you hear it? Do you hear uh -huh. his heartbeat? I hear some guys. Might be a brute, considering that they've got an arena for you, and they want to show you their new guy. Okay. Okay. Will he purposely avoid these? Uh, some of them do. Some of them are not smart, though. There they are. Hey, you dirty hose. Careful, now. Come and fight me. I'm over here and fight us. Come over here. Um, so the Ripper gets a little bit away from you. Oh, they're the green ones. Pop it. Get in. And you can also move it up and down. <laughs> Get more stuff off of them. Ah, uh, sorry. It's okay. It's a new weapon still. And these guys are upgraded. Is he smacking me with another guy? No, there's a thing stuck to him. On your right. Bad move. So you don't need to get totally all up in them. Fourth death, that's okay. Let's stop counting. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't mind. If you don't mind. <sighs> My balls are exposed. Live on stream. Okay, so I'm not going to try and just trick them into... You know. So the Ripper will hit a couple of feet away from you. What? You haven't looked at Sarah? You haven't looked at the whole room. Okay, cool. I thought I did. It benefits you to give it a proper real good once over the whole time. Uh, when I stomp, I keep thinking I'm hitting breadcrumbs. It's um, so cute though that it's called breadcrumbs, by the way. Yeah. Hello? Monsters? So you can get in if an enemy is totally stunned, but these guys have a shitload of hyper armor. So the Ripper might be good to get away from them. And now that you've upgraded the plasma cutter enough... Oh, there's a guy stuck to his arm. You're right. So even with your upgraded plasma cutter, it still takes two shots to cut through the limb on these guys. 
because their flesh has been compressed and is a lot tougher. That was one more Another shot. One. Yep, good. Focus on one leg. Arm off. Can you kinesis him? Oh, thanks. Thanks. Yes. We're good. Right on. So, um, again, plasma cutter, really solid. So yeah, um, green necromorphs have like a weird compressed thing with their flesh going on. Um, skip 20 seconds ahead if you don't want to hear spoilers, but as you already know, because I kind of spoiled it for you, uh, the, po the point of this is convergence and the point of that is to make a moon out of flesh, you know? Mm. And so compressing the flesh and getting it as tight and compact as you can is a way to ensure that that happens the way that you want it to. Uh, the Dead Space 2 spoilers are over. If you recall, I told Sarah them because I didn't know that she would be playing it, especially so soon after I told her the spoilers. Ah! Don't Get panic. tentacles. There you go. Great. Now go step on him. Perfect. Outstanding. I'm just going to do a little once over over here. Because the second you push the button, something will happen. Obviously. Obviously. I hate saying that because that makes me like, it's so metagaming. But... It, 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 is, it is metagaming in the highest degree. Like, there is nothing that you can call that besides metagaming. I don't, like, I don't, I don't think it's obvious, but um, it, it's kind of like a word. It's kind of like a sentence filler at this point, I think. <laughs> And the thing that might happen might just be, well, there you go. It might just be a, a dialogue thing. I was literally going to say the, the thing that might happen might just be dialogue. But, like... Do you hear it? It's going to be something. Oh, in the distance. Now, how many do you think there are? One of them just got hung up. Get away, get away. Oh, you bastard. So those guys just... It's an infector! What does that mean? The t t flying guys who infect corpses. So, uh, what do I do? Uh, uh kill it, but good. Uh, uh. Yep, him. He's a good victim of the Ripper, if that interests you, but it looks like he's dead. I don't know if that's the only one, so be careful. There might be more Necros in here than you thought. They might be fucking making more. One guy just stepped in it. I'm going to have to backtrack to get that goodie, so I'm just going to do it now. And I am trying to be very careful, because I really don't want to have to do this whole sequence again. But, I mean, this Remember game... Remember look up as well? Because the thing that you want might be stuck on the ceiling. Interesting. ring a ding, -ding. Oh. Yeah, because of the gravity. Excuse me. <clears throat> Blech. All we've eaten today is fast food. I'm sick, and Sarah was like, it'll help you. And I was like, you know what? It will. And it did. <sighs> Sometimes just some greasy, fast food coats your stomach so nicely. And Sarah will quote the pseudoscience and say that the grease will coat your stomach and inure you to things like vomiting. Yeah. I think that the, the, the comfort of it is what does it. I think it's all psychosomatic. No, it coats your tummy. I love pseudoscience sometimes. I love that you call it Suedo instead of Pseudo. Damn it. Ooh, power lock. What are you doing? I was trying to punch it. How do you punch again? Uh, It's just the same as shoot. Your attacks are always your attacks. Got it. Just aim is what changes them. Well, the step is RB. Yeah. And that's alt fire. Oh, I it guess just it so is. happens that alt fire on the plasma cutter, your favorite. All right. That's is just plot. turn. Oh, it feels like plot. I don't know. It's not because it's in this room you probably can't get yeah. to. So it just look at that. These are all primo supremo optional doors. So we've got two thousand. We've got some amazing med kit. Ripper Chan. Oh damn. Hmm. All right. Let's see if we can throw something out. Another pause. Large med pack. Uh, ditch the um, 
Stasis and a single plasma energy. Isn't there a store nearby? I don't know how close it is. Uh, I guess it isn't very close, huh? Hmm. Oh, well. Balls. Remember that you can get a triangle to go right to the inventory? Oh, thank you. So get rid of these? Get rid of the single stack one. Yep, there you go. And then... And then we got two to be getting on with. Let me just make sure I'm... What? Did I just pick up those things? Yep. I was trying to reload. On one hand, I'm very grateful that, um... Things don't just go away when you drop them, like in other games. Yeah. But on the other. Hmm. Now, if you want, we can go there, run back. I might. That would be fine. I can just cut it out. The Ooh. hell is this room? Text log. Well, now I can cut the whole thing out. Initial infection vectors. It's been less than an hour, but they've spread fast. Flight deck was the first to go after the shuttle crashed. Now almost entirely overrun. We've lost at least half the med deck and a quarter of engineering. No information about cargo or planet operations, which suggests bad news. This is not what I expected. It's so nice to be here playing with you. While I was gone over the summer, it was really fun. Sorry, you just looked at those and didn't what? pick them up. Do you have room I for them? I can't. I don't have room. Okay, cool. Uh, Pardon my stern tone. No, it's okay. Uh, wow, we have to come back. But I appreciate it, mm -hmm. my sweet boy. Um, Come on, Node. But it's really nice to be in person. Uh, oh, God, we have to go back. Um, there it's good to be in person. So many goodies. To play games. Especially since when I was uh, long distance, it sounded like I was recording on a toaster. Well, you can actually see um, this is the mic that I have, and it's what I, this is the one I use for streaming. Sarah, show them your mic. Yeah, it's this piece of shit. <laughs> so... I mean, they're decent headphones, but the mic quality uh, it leaves a little leaves a little uh, leaves a little to be desired. Yeah. Wait. Mm. Leaves a lot to be desired. Well, you can say it leaves a little if you want to be coy about it. Oh. You know what else you can do if you want to be coy about it? Be a fish. Yeah, you, you, you like, and that's how you eat all your food. Uh, level three. Uh, I think two is where we want. Oh, do you hear that? He's having... He's having uh, everywhere at the end of time moments. Oh, man. You know, I was considering making a video about that album. Very interesting. Uh, let it be known that I used to have a terrible fear of getting dementia when I was older. I, uh, I mean, when... Wasn't it when you were younger? When I was younger, about getting dementia when I was when, older. Oh, yeah, of course. Oh, shit, I forgot we picked that up. Okay. Sell, this, uh, sell the gold semiconductor? Yep. And I think that it's worth it to sell the large med pack. Because rarely do you need that much healing. And it's, I mean, look at it. It's fucking 5,000 money. I mean, yeah. Sure. Um, honestly, now that I'm looking at it, you might even be able to sell a line rack. Maybe the small one? Maybe the small one, yeah. Um, you can sell and order Ripper Blades if you want. Definitely sell a Plasma Energy. There's only two, though. Uh, sell a Stasis Pack. Um. So, let's take a look at that Contact Beam, huh? Yeah. Uh. High Damage Energy Projector. Remember how I have... Should I just get it? No, you don't have to if you don't want to. Okay. Tell but me remember how every gun has a loose sort of equivalent, like the line gun is your shotgun, your plasma cutter is the pistol, 
Um, Ooh, how do I move things into my safe? Uh, I don't know. I've never done it. But click on the line rack. Just a line rack? Oh, line rack ammo. Yeah. Move. There we go. Wow. I've loaded two, I would say. Okay. Or one in a ripper blade uh, stack. Uh, yeah. Um, and then save your money, but let's go run back. Mm hmm So, contact beam. We're, we're playing this the way Sarah wants, by the way, so fuck you guys if you want us to just get on with it. No. Look, this is what I would do. I would do it as granular and safe as possible. And granted, part of that would be because I'm doing it on Zealot. I'm playing Dead Space 2 on Zealot, and I'm using it everything that I can to get ahead of the game. I mean, this goes along with a thing of, like, I don't know, I want to hear you guys. Uh, like, if anybody has any opinions to offer, I would love to hear it. What's your favorite gun? What do you think is the most objectively good to use? Um, uh, Unless you think it's the plasma cutter. I've heard a lot about how the plasma cutter is great. Well, I mean, maybe someone has a new opinion, so... <laughs> I'm always up to I'm hear it. Did I save? So, by the way, the first chapter is called New Arrivals. In case you want to look at that and see the names of the chapters. So, it's New Arrivals, Intensive Care, Course Correction, and Obliteration Imminent. So, we got... Wait, where's chapter one? Well, we don't have a save from chapter one. Oh. Uh. Because we start it... Chapter one, we can just start the whole game over. So, I don't need a save at the start of it. So, what's chapter one's name? New Arrivals. So new arrivals in I C I don't know. Okay. Nothing from N I C O. Nicholas? Nikolai? I'm I'm gonna blow a piece of my skull out through my head. My brain's going to explode, and a chunk of my skull... Am I close? ...this big is just going to go... Whoosh, Am I close? ...off to the side. Uh, yeah, kind of. Uh, Nicole? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, his wife! <laughs> Duh! <laughs> of course, it must be Nicholas! <laughs> who is Nicholas? I will find out. I must know. As soon as I find out who Nicholas is, I will have cracked the code of Dead Space 1. As soon as I figure out who that is. Blam, blam, blam. This is the bench, by the way. I love that song you use for... Um... You uh, you got turned yep, completely yep, around. Yep, yep, yep. I like that song you used to... Time Lapse? Time Lapse. It's the little... Uh, that song is Smoking Roll from God Hand. Uh, God Hand is uh, possibly the greatest game of all time if you haven't played it. Uh, if you haven't played it, play it. The greatest unplayable game of all time. Oh my god, it might be the hardest game ever. Uh, but yeah, I agree. I really had a good time. We watched, um, I think... Wooly and Pat, Pat, yeah. Pat from Two Best Friends play. Um, you know, rip, rest in peace. But uh, they played it, and it was just, I love seeing I love seeing those two just get together and really take on a game put, like that. Put their heads together and just work on a hard game together. It's it's gripping. Um, I have so many similar similarities to Wooly. It is... Uh, what? What? Why does it want you to power node? Weird. Huh, well, let's try it. No, 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 no. What if it uses it and then you don't have one? That's so weird. Is that a bug or? I don't. I don't know. But I really don't want you to have well, one I just, power I wanted node. Well, I wanted to just see yeah. if it would let me do it. And apparently it will, so. <sighs> um... Fucking video games, man. As I was saying, but yeah, you pointed out to me how similar I am to... And, like, appearance-wise, me and... Jeff. Wooly, Wooly cannot be uh, any more different. Yeah, like, uh, a super tall, like, broad-shouldered, like... Handsome. <laughs> You're handsome. Yeah. Wooly's cute, as well. Wooly is cute. But yeah, like, super tall, broad-shouldered... He's, he's, like, fashionable. Yeah, he you know? is. Have you seen him in a suit at his, like, wedding? Looks no. so fucking rad. I'll show you the pictures later. Where Can are you we... going? Hello? 
That's a guy who's just stuck in the beam, I think. Careful walking backwards oh. while looking up. Uh, there's nothing else here, right? Yeah, you got everything. We came back to get everything okay, that cool. you already got. Um. Or that you'd miss. But yeah, so I'm a lot like Willie. giant, like super tall, broad-shouldered, like huge, muscular black dude. Sarah, tall, no, broad-shouldered, not really. <sighs> but yeah, like teeny tiny little, like. I am average super size. Pale lady. I am like five foot four. I'm like the average American woman's weight. Maybe a little overweight, but like, um. You get your, you're like, oh, teeny tiny little woman. And I'm just like, you're a behemoth. You're yeah. six foot five. I am. You're huge. You know, I'm even taller when I wear a hat. <laughs> um, <laughs> if we get you a good pair of heels, you're going to be unstoppable. Yeah. I was thinking about that, actually. I was thinking about getting shoes with lifts in them. I remember telling people about that in high school, and they were like, what the fuck do you mean you want shoes with what lifts? What a great way to do this, by the way. Yeah. Up. Breadcrumbs, man. It's an amazing system. And, like, you can't put it in any game. Like, there, there's the clairvoyance spell in Skyrim, and that kind of works. And they tried to do the same thing with Vans in um, Fallout 4, but it does not work the same. It's not as good at all. You have to spend a perk on it as well. It's crap. Um, but, like, clairvoyance is just really convenient. Right off the bat, huh? Right away. I could have got him. Is that Nicholas? This is Temple. The bridge is fucked. I don't know what Oh, it's our friend Temple again. I'm sticking around in case whatever did it comes back. I'm heading for hydroponics to find Elizabeth. Schematic. The force gun. Oh, we got distracted from that. The force so every gun in this is loosely applicable to a resident evil weapon. Line gun is your shotgun, plasma cutter is your pistol. Do it with me. Hmm. Ooh, ooh, ooh. The ooh. little, the little, hear the squeeze? Yeah, I do, I do like the doop when you pick something up. Anyway, so, um, the contact beam and the force cannon I think you just picked up are similar to, well, it's a big show! It's a big show! Sorry, I promised that I would do that. I don't know who I promised. I think it was just myself. Did he, fuck, did he like bounce one of your shots off of his arm blades? You got him. Last bolt in the chamber. That's good. How was that? Pretty good. Sorry. <laughs> but yeah, I, I promised that I would sing uh, the Big Show song whenever we saw one of the fat necromorphs. <laughs> What's the what's the one guy um, dearly departed from us? Uh, God, what's his name? It's like <sighs> he like sings when he's introducing the Undertaker. Oh, Paul Bearer. Paul Bearer. Oh, 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 I see the evil in your eyes, but you know my Undertaker will destroy <laughs> him at SummerSlam. <laughs> like, <laughs> Paul Bearer is the best. Rest in peace, man. Uh, if you guys didn't know, uh, I mean, why would you? I was really into wrestling, uh, WWE specifically, in my, uh, when I was a child, basically. Um, hey, your breadcrumbs? For a long time, I thought it was real. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, when you're a kid, there's no excuse for not knowing, you know? Or there is an excuse for not knowing. It's that you're <laughs> there's a kid. There's no fucking excuse. Look, Grow kids, up. fuck them kids. I feel myself filling up. Like, I feel like like I should be waddling right now. <laughs> Isaac's fanny pack is having trouble uh, zipping uh, shut. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> That's okay. No. Uh, switch to the line gun. We'll get some of that hefty ammo out of your backpack. Down. My bad. Okay. Line gun for the next fight. Sure. Uh, if you use the whole clip, it'll fill up a, it'll free up a slot. Yep. But yeah, line gun ammo is uh, scarce. So, you have room on that controller for four guns. Mm hmm Um, and you now have four guns back at the shop that you don't have in your pocket. 
and that is the pulse rifle, the flamethrower, the Dalgona coffee maker. What the fuck is it called? The contact beam. That's what it is. I. What do these remind me of? <sighs> Gartham. Yeah. Also, they kind of like my suit. Yes. What does your suit look like? Uh, ribs. So you don't know it yet, but ribs is kind of the vague idea designed for the marker. It's a DNA spiral that tapers on the end, like an obelisk. One second. Uh, sorry, what were you saying? I was just saying that um, the marker is a kind of like a DNA spiral, kind of like ribs, but it tapers to pieces. Uh, it tapers. Uh, it tapers on the end like an obelisk, and it's in a bunch of different pieces. These look like razors. Yeah, they kind of do. It, it. I'm threatened in this room. Mm -hmm. You know, I feel very threatened. What are these? What was this designed for? You know. It looks like it's for vents, but it's. It could be just like one of those oh, like. This would be a bitch to clean. <laughs> Can you imagine getting in there? You gotta get the hose just, on oh. every rung all the way down. Of course. No one's going to do it themselves. They're going to leave it to fucking housekeeping. Yep. Isaac, get the hose and uh, rinse those down for me because of uh, the the, uh, the necromorphs. Isaac is the, the Ishimura's personal bitch. <laughs> he is. What did they want from me again? I don't remember. Well, considering you've got some cover here, you're probably going to have to hunker down behind this. Like now? Uh, am I hunkered? Yeah. I should probably get out from under. And then now you're good. Remember that you can LB to sprint? Uh, I am. Okay, cool. Oh, yeah, I can't hear the sounds of sprinting because of the vacuum. This reminds me of Star Trek. Specifically the licensed Xbox 360 video game for the Star Trek reboot movie. Specifically that Star Trek. The Star Trek that nobody thinks of when anyone says Star Trek. FYI. Woof. That's rough. Squishy. Um, I was being greedy. Yeah, I could see that you were getting scared about your health emptying. If you like, we can turn back, pick up the med, uh, the air can, and drop a stasis. Sure. Just in case. Just in case. Might be good. Um, so what happens if his air starts running out? You choke to death. Nope. Right there. Drop a stasis, because holy shit, you've got four of them. <laughs> I have quite a bit. And I'm not using them. Yeah, uh, stasis so is kind of hard to... Just in case something is out there for me to pick up. And you really want it. And I really want it. Smart. Just thinking ahead. So, something that I was trying I to talk about I just picked him up again. I picked him up again. I... I... <sighs> Sorry, go on. Something I was trying to tell you about earlier. There are four guns that you can hold at once. And there are four guns that you have not bought yet. So I have some picking to do. You can pick out your fourth gun. You can also wait and see, but there are only eight guns That's and bullshit. you have seven of them. Can I walk over these? No. So, um, you've got the pulse rifle, which is okay. Might be the worst gun in this game, but it has its uses. Go. Thank you. Let's not be greedy. Uh, yeah, you have the pulse rifle. I could have been greedy. You have the flamethrower. You have the force cannon and the contact beam. And we don't have to pick any of those this time. We can wait until next time to pick them. Oh, God, I'm greedy. Just in time. Open your inventory and use the... Air can. Where is it? It says air can. Here? Yep. All right. It's kind of weird that you have to use it. I guess you could also oh, really? upgrade your air. Um, but almost no one does that because you always have enough air to get to be getting on with. And again, Isaac has the fucking lungs of a newborn kitten. Ooh. 
Yeah. A slobber knocker right there. The the minute I just I decide to do a decision. Isaac sticks his toe out and it gets blown off by shrapnel. Go, Isaac, go. Haul ass. So, um Oh, come on. In the real world. In the real world, uh, meteor impacts are not like they are in Star Wars. You don't get, you don't run into like just a shitload of, nice. You don't run into just like a whole load of, of you know, impact. You don't need to worry about that. However, it could be that this okay. is so huge that it's getting, just walk away. Yep. There we go. This could just be a case where it's so damn huge that it's drawing things in with gravity. Oh no, no, I hate this part of every video game, please. Why is it in every video game? Do I have a limited amount? I don't think so. Shit, shit, shit! Fuck, it's the right stick, and like, uh, it's just the right stick. I, and, uh, I hate this part of every single video. Okay, I'm gonna die here, folks. Why is, like, Bayonetta might be a perfect game, but it, even Bayonetta has a turret sequence. Spec Ops The Line is a great game, and yet uh, it has a turret sequence. I'm gonna try it one more time, and then we would do it for me. Yes. Thanks. I hate the turret sequence. What's your uh, problem with only using the right stick? You can only... Well, see, you. I shoot here, and so it's kind of awkward to move this and try to... I have small hands. Okay. Does that make sense? Does that clear it up for you? Yeah, that clears it up because okay. shooting and using the right stick at the same time is a pretty open and shut case for most, you know, normal sized humans. It's pretty cool that you can see the fucking warheads they use. <sighs> Damn, did I miss it? Yeah. Familiar with ABS? No. It means always be shooting. You know, Wayne Gretzky once said, you miss 100% of the shots you don't take. But it does help to hit the shots that you do. He didn't say that part. He was focused on playing hockey, I think. Whatever it is Wayne Gretzky does. One more? Are you out of your mind? Dude! What you, whatever your name is, Hammond? Oh, can you cut this out? Just, this is embarrassing for me. <laughs> Alright. Okay, no promises. We might have to turn the sensitivity up for that part, by the way. It's really bad. Mm. Sorry for soaking the controller again. Again. I have hyperhidrosis. Tell them about it. You just mentioned that you have Palmer hyperhidrosis, but you don't give any details. Uh, it's a nerve issue. It just, it's literally just inconvenient and embarrassing. It makes your palms really sweaty. <laughs> like, you know how if you get nervous, you get a little sweaty sometimes? Well, all that sweat is concentrated in my palms. So... I used to be uh, really embarrassed about shaking people's hands and, you know, well, you shake people's hands. Usually you're in a nerve wracking situation like an interview or you're, you're meeting someone and, um, and I would just be so embarrassed because my hands were always just sopping, you know? And, um, so I started telling people, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, I just put lotion on right now. My hands are a little wet, but it's great to meet you. Pretty good excuse if you have Palmer hyperhidrosis. Oh, sorry, I just, you know, have lotion on. And at some point, I actually just started saying, like, uh, my hands are sweaty right now. A lot of people appreciate that honesty. All 
I could just I could see what Alfred puts uh, as he skips through this section. Sarah talking about her sweaty hands again. Bam, bam, bam. You're doing great. Uh, this sucks, man. It fucking sucks. Is there a fucking, like, school of video games where they're like, the turret sequence, lesson one? No. Fuck you, Hammy. Shit's hard. Ugh, God, this is pain. All right, guys, get ready to hear the speed up track. <laughs> Starting with... That's my impression of Elvis. You know, if you talk, it makes me not want to skip through it. Oh, really? Yeah. I don't know. I don't have much to say. I'm just going to complain about the turret sequence. Like, uh, I remember Alfred almost gave up on RE5 with me because of the turret sequence and that. It's really hard, and Ruben I mean, Langdon shouting at you. That one's pretty, um, I mean, Ruben Langdon is every character in every game ever, so. I mean, he's like two. He's like three, but he just lives at the Capcom offices, I guess. Yeah. Because <laughs> he's Ken in Street Fighter, a Capcom game. And he's Dante, the Devil Hunter. You know, there is... Um, Bayonetta, at least, kind of drops you off halfway through the turret sequence instead of you having to start the whole damn thing over. Yeah. Okay, then again, RE5 also does that, but... <sighs> Not enough during that fucking turret sequence. Oh, you can run out. Oh, but you can also shoot with the left and right. That changes things. Fuck. Please don't compromise my focus. Just a little longer. Yeah, I've heard I've heard it, Hammond. Hey, girls are watching. Girls are gonna be disappointed. Oh god. Hammond! The turret sequence is so fucking bad. Here, let me try it again. Sensitivity's up, right? Yeah. You sure? Yes. I'm gonna pick this damn thing up. We need it. We'll turn it back down. Later. <laughs> Angry. He hates him too. I... Why is it in every game? It doesn't need to be there. He's like, all right, let's do it. I shot a 15 times. Okay, so you can run out of ammo. Okay, fuck you. Okay, big ones break into smaller rules. Smaller things. That's the rules of Asteroid. And it's been that way for 50 years. Okay. Turret sequence still sucks, though. Okay. I'm already losing a lot. I keep wanting to... Give up, let me do it again. Okay. Oh yeah, I also just have to die. I can't believe that there's no restart from checkpoint button in this game. There is in Dead Space 2. Not in this one. <sighs> Alright, what's your favorite turret sequence? Bayonetta. That's fair. That Spec Ops The Line has an okay one as well. I mean, it sucks, but it's the first thing you do. That was my most enjoyable time, was with Bayonetta. 
just get by and we're dead. I think I've almost got the system prepared. Just buy me a little more time. He sells a little more time. Like, that's the same a little more time your mom says when she's talking on the phone and you're waiting to go to the park or something. Or you're in, like, the supermarket and, and she sees another mom. It's like, oh my, my fucking god. god. Just a little more time, sweetie. It's like, schedule time to see your fucking friends. Divorce your husband. Make time, you know? If you only want to see your friends on other people's time, that makes you a bad person. This is my time, mom. We just got cookie crunch and I want to go home and have a bowl. It's been a hard day. It's been a hard day. It's Miller time, says the child. What if he was just like, Isaac, just 10 more minutes? Isaac, just 20 more minutes. I would just, you would just pull out the gun and shoot yourself in the head again. There actually is an ending of Dead Space where Isaac pulls out a gun and shoots himself in the brain. Oh, really? Yeah, if you fail the boss, uh, the final boss of Dead Space 2. Oh. Fuck that. What? I was shooting right at it. It doesn't help that your huge ass gun can actually obscure the screen. So what's the worst turret sequence? This. Not KOTOR 2? Or KOTOR 1? Oh, thank fuck. KOTOR 1 has a pretty bad turret sequence. Did I play it yet? The turret sequence? Yeah, remember? Oh, so it's just shooting it now? By itself? Yeah. Save! 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 Okay, okay, okay. God. <laughs> May we never need you again. God. Thank so. fuck. Oh, this place has gone to the fucking dogs. Yeah. So there's probably going to be necros on the way back. Yep. Bold move. Let's see if it works. I wanna, there you go. This is probably acceptable, right? I need to go breathe, man. Fuck off. Hey, la dee da, Mr. Necromorph doesn't need to use his lungs to turn oxygen into carbon dioxide. But some of us gotta work for a living, Mr. Necromorph. Taking our, taking all our jobs. Oh, there. Getting people killed for no reason is the Ishimura's job, not Necromorph. Alright. We did it, though. We survived. We did it. We can pick these stupid fucking stasis packs up. No, we can't. Hey, you're full. Whatever. We'll sell that Ruby Semiconductor. Isaac Hammond. You're not gonna believe this. Oh, what is it now? Oxygen levels are falling. Something's poisoning hydroponics air production, and whatever it is, it's filling the deck up with that organic stuff. We're not going to have any air to breathe soon. But if I understand these lab reports correctly, I think I can make a poison to Down, destroy it. Mm -hmm. Head to medical. It should have everything Ah, a poison to destroy the poison. Isaac, get to medical and mix Listen, we just need to get on a helicopter. To it needs to be around sunset. Possibly my favorite sunrise. quote from Pat, again, of Two Best Friends Play, but possibly my favorite thing that he has ever said is... Every Resident Evil character gets on a helicopter at the end of their game, and they sit back, and they're like, it's finally over. And they're always, always, always wrong. It's never over. And they are. You know, it's over for, like, a summer, you know? They get their they get their summer, summer break. They get yeah. the holiday off. Uh, all right. All right. Uh, for real, though. Uh, another save. Worst turret sequence? I don't know. Was there another save? Don't so you remember KOTOR? There's a necromorph. The turret... Uh, stop. Okay, stop spinning the camera. Necromorph right there. Remember when you're leaving the Ebon Hawks. 
Sorry. Uh, I can't spin this gun, right. Okay, remember when you're leaving Taurus on the Evan Hawk. Oh, fuck. You know what the worst one is? Kingdom Hearts. Oh! Yeah, you know I'm right. Don't even... Uh. Kingdom Hearts 1. Kingdom Hearts 1. Still haven't beaten Kingdom Hearts 1, and for and good reason. For that reason. For that reason. There are other problems with Kingdom Hearts 1. The gummy ship is one of them. Um, I do want to finish it, you know? Yeah, I want to see what all the hype is, but I... I uh, again, my friend Robert gave me the lowdown on Kingdom Hearts, and, like, uh, level 2 is the shop. Thank you. Um, by the way, new enemy, I think? Uh, yes. Uh, the splitter, I want to say? The baby doll heads? Well, if you noticed, it was a head with tentacles coming out of it, and I want to say, like, an arm. Play the game. Is this thing in dead space an enemy or a gun? <laughs> the cutter. The splitter. Yeah. Okay. So, heading that way takes you to the shop, but it's also the critical path. If you want, you can double back and hit the bench. Where's the bench? But you should go to the shop first and buy your stuff. Okay. First, let's sell that Ruby Sebi conductor. You got it. And that right there is one node. It was 10,000. Sell a stasis pack or two. And if you want to sell a plasma energy or a line rack, we'll have enough for another node. Well, like a full one. We good? We're like 125 short of a node. Hmm. You think? Yeah. Why not? And if you want, we can also take a look at the contact beam and the force gun and the other guns. Sorry, where are the guns? Up at the top. Okay. All right, we got the pulse rifle. I've not heard good things. <laughs> It's okay. It's, uh, it is actually decent for dealing with the really small guys that are very many. Very many. Uh, that's really cute. So like the swarm, I think they're called. We got the flamethrower. Cool. Again, good for the swarm. Force gun? What do you think? It's like the magnum. And a heavy damage energy projector. Okay. What do you recommend? I, what do you think I would like? So, I haven't used the contact beam ever. Okay. I'm curious. And you want to get four nodes? Yep. Boy, if that doesn't put a smile on your face. Alright, head back to the elevator. What the hell? Ugh, that's a bad noise. Go to level one. Close the door, close the door. I don't know what's in that room. That's a pro- that's for a future, Isaac. Yeah, that's another pro- that's a different problem for later. I'm so handsome. So, if you like, you can sink two dud nodes into your rig. Mm -hmm, sure. And then save putting the node to upgrade your health in, because that should like fill you up. Is it here? Yeah. Yeah. Gotcha. So you can put the two dud nodes in, and it'll get your rig close to another health upgrade. And then whenever you need that health, you can just put a note in. Air, though. You can get air if you want. Might as well. And then we'll just save that. Why? Because it'll fill your health up. Oh, sure. Um, so, yeah, whenever we have a spare one, we can go and get it. 
So I would avoid uh, getting capacity unless you want to upgrade your... Uh, unless you're low on ammo. You know, I haven't done anything with the Ripper yet. Yeah. Why the hell not, you know? Why not? Um, and then I would save those two so you can put one on rig as soon as you need and then still have one for the key. Yep. Sounds good to me. Great. That's all four. I feel good. How about mm -hmm. you? So, um, one thing is that you have the Ripper to deal with problems that are small and many. Because um, the Ripper can deal with a lot of things, but it's oh, really safe. good at going through more than one problem at a time. Did I save? Better save. That one was honest. <laughs> I was like, did that save? It, it took too short of a month of a time. It's it's something that's about... Oh, yeah, point the, uh, point the uh, cannon. Right on the D-pad? Okay. No, it's... That's... Sarah? Yes. That's the line gun. That's the Ripper. Right on the D-pad. Oh, I'm sorry. It's so weird because it's so close. All right. Shoot. If you like, we'll just have to load the save. What was that? Clear space. What's that? It's the same one. It clears space? No, you just did the same thing twice. Hold it down. So what is this? What do you think? Cool. Rocket launcher. Takes time. Takes time. But it'll... How do I load? Uh, We fucking quit to the main menu. Oh. Yeah. And then we load game. Yeah, it's a pain. That is a pain. I don't know why there's no easy, like, retry or load or checkpoint button in the menu. But yeah, that's the, uh, that's the new gun you have. Well, awesome. Okay, let me realign myself. Uh, bottom is line gun. Left is my chainsaw. Uh, plasma cutter. Grenade launcher. What is this called? Pretty much. Um, I would like to, I, I want to call it by its... Okay, because we got the force cannon and contact beam right next to each other. I think this is the force cannon. But you can open your inventory with Y. Tringle. Ah, uh, it's not a good idea to do right now. Damn, that's I'm, so annoying. They. I mean, I can't. I just. I don't think it's a great idea to do because. Um... Oh, oh it's the. Uh... Ripper. Contact beam. There's a monster in here, so I was just afraid of it. Yeah. Might have despawned, though. Yeah. Weird. That is weird. What qualms? All right, so Isaac is a pretty... Oh, I'm gonna have to bonk you with my trident! Oh, fuck. What gun did I have? I... Okay. You were just... What What do you want, dear? Sorry, I thought I thought I had it on the, um... Too many guns! There's just four. You had it on the contact beam. Okay, I did have it on the contact beam yes. then? Yes. Okay, cool. And that requires you to have to charge up, so it's better if you have space. Might want to crotch that guy. You think so? Yeah. Cool. It's a way of making sure that they drop something. You're all full. Again. I was trying. Oh, boy. There's been an attempt. Jesus. Oh, so <laughs> I'm losing it. You are losing it. <sighs> Was he supposed to go so slow like that? You stasis him. Oh, I guess I did. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my lord. I'm sundowning, but the the sun is so down, you know? Yeah. Alright, that's the end of the chapter. Oh shit, that's the end of the chapter? Yeah. Already? 
Already? Already? I'm having such a good time with you. <sighs> Keep recording. Really? Yeah. Ah! I'm gonna get no sleep tonight. Part six or seven of me avoiding my homework. <laughs> I'm not. I did my homework tonight. Save your shit. Uh... Uh, no. What? What'd I do? <laughs> We've been trying to save. Right. On the... Sorry. <sighs> I got distracted. In case anyone wants to know what it's like living with an adult <laughs> giant rat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No fucking object permanence. <laughs> can you save again? Yes. I don't know if you can. I'm just... I'm not asking you to. I'm just wondering... Okay, so it just screwed up forever. Isaac, I can smell the contaminated air from here. It's spreading faster than I expected. I'm trying to isolate it, but it's not going to buy us much time. We have to get that thing off this ship. The chemicals you need are in the chemistry lab. I'll hack the door for you when you get there. I guess it's fine since we usually try to do that at the start of episodes. I'm sorry, you're not actually upset, are you? No, of course not. I would advise against head bonking when we both have headphones on oh. and we're sitting in a nest of wires. But don't you feel so loved? I feel fear. <laughs> well, it looks great in here, guys. Um, what does Anna say? I don't know. I will try to be more flame fuel mm -hmm. for the beam. No. Probably for the flamethrower. Gotcha. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. Uh, so it's just dumping gasoline all over the contact beam. Like, <laughs> Why isn't it working? <laughs> um, I will try to be more... What's the word for not distracted? Focused. Focused. <laughs> I am really trying. Uh, evacuate this area immediately. F one of these times. You can't stand in the way of God's plan. The natural order. Are you. Are you blind left to rest? God, the fucking Jehovah Witnesses are knocking at my door again. Looks like someone has reprogrammed the door locks on this deck. And recently, too. I guess we're not alone here after all. Someone doesn't want you in this part of the ship. Um. Oh, you worked really hard for me to. For me to, like, have all those separate saves. I'm so sorry. Well, I just. I, the, the thing that I want to do is make sure that, like, in case a recording is botched, then we can go back to before we did a recording. Mm. And I guess that we can just load the one that is at the start of a real recording. But yeah, that is the what? reason that you're really supposed to rotate your saves in Let's Playing, by the way. Yeah. Because, um, like, what are you going to do if you just overwrite a save and then the recording gets fucked up? They wrote two. I mean, I guess this is Red Marker. But what a great look casual scare here. Yeah. Um, good job on them. There's a lot of good stuff that went in here. I will now make a new save. Yes. Again, I apologize. And if you like, if you notice, this one is Lethal Devotion, which begins with L. Further proving For the Nicholas, Nicholas theory. <laughs> <laughs> what about that tickles you so bad? The concept of a Nicholas theory? <laughs> Nicole was right there. That's what's killing me. You've met her. You've talked to her. Welcome to the lab. If you refer to the lab. Sarah on your right. Uh, the other one. I, my left? Yeah. That's what I meant when I said the other one. Okay. I'm hitting it. Or maybe I'm not. Nice. 
it's just so funny to me that I was like, Nicholas, of course. Uh, it's gonna be like a thirty nice. gigabyte recorded. <laughs> These, these sessions keep getting longer and longer. The last one we did, we actually did two and three. And I got at least three episodes of stuff out of it. I haven't even finished editing it all yet, but there's a daily huge of it. This is such... Uh, I know it doesn't seem like it, but this is so relaxing after being in lab all day. Well, that's the thing. It's, it's something that people don't appreciate about Halloween. Or rather, it's something that people sometimes only appreciate around Halloween. But, like, being scared in a controlled environment. Because, like, oh, obviously. Oh, it's such a fucking relief. Being scared of, like, oh, no, I can't pay my bills or I'm going to get stabbed by an axe murderer or something like that. That is scary, you know? But being scared in a controlled environment. Like, I'm going to watch this hour and a half movie and something scary during it will happen to me almost definitely. That's fun. You know? Well, I have friends who, you know, think I'm fucking nuts for liking horror movies. And, uh fair <laughs> maybe but um i just you know it's the same kind of reason you watch any type of you know movie you want to feel something you want to feel you know your journaling going yeah um and i really like the high you know why do you watch an action movie it's because it's high risk and it's like put that horror in there um i'm also an adrenaline junkie it's probably why I like Blood Bank so much. Uh, uh, I'm going to save them. Yep. I don't know if you've noticed, but we're back in the medical ward, by the way. Wait, we were here before? Yes. Where was I? We're, was I, I mean, in space? We're back in the medical ward, okay? I taught you um, about the phrase space cadet. Yeah, uh, I thought it, I thought it was like a way to say that someone is like fun loving and eager and like ready to work. Well, and I said Careful. Uh shoot. There you go. So we saw a couple guys that were kind of like that before. And uh they've uh, they've just gotten worse. Uh and I said no, space cadet is usually a way to refer to um Why am I back here? Because we need something from here? No. My money. Um, space Cadet is a way to refer to as like someone who's kind of like spacey, not here. They're like... A... How do you say it? Um... Aloof. Um... Get off the boat, get off the boat, get off the boat. <laughs> what is that from? Mulan? Yeah. Or it's get off the ship. No. Let's get, get off, off the, the roof. roof. What am I thinking of? I probably saw a parody sometime and just took that to heart. Um, what did I need from here? Okay. Have you listened to any of the dialogue for the last... I have... It is not sticking. That's fair, because most of it is like, Isaac, we're incapable of wiping our own asses. Can you go get some toilet paper? Okay, hold on. Once you get the chemicals, you're also going to need a DNA sample of the alien tissue. Is this to help the poison? Yes. Okay, okay. We're making, an, we're making a poison to help the poison. Specifically, what Isaac's we're doing poison. is... There is a... There is infectious tissue in the air, which isn't really poisonous to us, but it will infect us. And your stupid spacesuit only has 70 seconds of air. Yeah. Chemical research lab. You know, that's an actual thing. Um, I was in the molecular lab today, and five weeks ago, during like the height of the second you know, a second height of COVID when they're getting about... Mm, we record these far in advance, by the way. Getting, the, getting about... I now have a live subject for my study. I'm eager to validate my tissue regeneration. I don't want to be here. I'm hearing, like, background, like... 
I'm not supposed to be in here. Call my wife. Do you hear that? Some real outlast shit. You were explaining Space Cadet? Uh, no, I was explaining... In my molecular... In the molecular lab, I'm training in... Wait, before you do that, look at these guys. Hello? Resident Evil? Yeah. But did you hear that note? Uh, people are getting tortured and turned into these guys? Somebody is putting necromorph tissue directly into the bodies of living adults. What the fuck, man? Just to see what'll happen. Um, anyway, recently, uh, you Can know... You pick up the second one? I just don't want to fill up, fill up. They do PCR, polymerase chain reaction, where they take some nucleic acid and amplify it to see, you know, if someone has, um, you know, some type of, you know, infectious process going on. This guy looks like he was pulled out of Dishonored. I'm here. Where, who are you talking? Oh, does he? Does he track? I guess. I think so. Yeah. Behind you. <sighs> okay, not not three. Good. Uh. I want the saw. Get him. Yeah, yeah. And get it into his limbs, yeah. Oh my god, he's so tough, though. Good, yeah, create space. Look back at him. Oh, I didn't know these showed up here. Run where? Behind you, that door. On, yep. Yep. Um, so I think a technique that you can use in two is that you can cut Here? off some limbs, probably. Oh, for the love of smite. Sh fuck. Oh, it's going bad to worse. Okay, make sure you're heading the right way, though. Thank you. Wait, are they even following me? Yes. No, I'm in the safe room. That that means very little. So anyway, um, if we have a bunch of, uh. DNA that can contaminate a sample and you want to make sure one sample doesn't contaminate another because just a little bit of, you know, DNA can make things positive. So they saw a rate that was six times higher than their normal rate of positivity and they're like, okay, now we have to bleach the entire lab from top to bottom. Do you want to look at him? Oh, sorry. I was... You might want to keep your hand on the... Sorry, we are full. Um, anyway, it's just one of those things where it's like, 
you there's so much just DNA and stuff floating in the air, and like obviously it's not gonna hurt you too fucking much, cause. I mean, we're breathing it in right now, aren't we? But, uh... You know what? When you're trying to do lab stuff, <laughs> it's a fucking problem. Some of these things you can kill, by the way. Oh, I can? Yes. It's just the one with big glowing eyes. What? Why can't I get past there? Probably you have a puzzle to do. Okay. You're running into a table. Should I just kill him? Some of these things you can kill. Which but one? they're a lot slower. Normal Necro? Oh, uh, that's, you're a, dead. that's a death. Amazing death sequence, by the oh, way. Oh, yeah. This game is, again, Space Ori 4. But all of the, like, grab deaths are really good. Um, I'm glad I saved. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully they'll checkpoint you, yep. Uh, so there's poison in the air. What's it doing to us? Uh, it's infectious tissue. Okay. And we're just breathing it in. Well, you aren't. Who's breathing it in? Kendra and Hammond. Oh, they don't have a suit? No. If you remember, you're the only one with a helmet. So if you look, you can see that that battery is sparking. Mm -hmm. And then hit your breadcrumbs? I know. No. So I don't know what this means. They're here, by the way. I'm looking for a battery somewhere. Pardon I me. don't know. But the fact that it is sparking makes me think that it would be important. Okay, he's dead. I don't think the Ripper at its current level of upgrade can kill that thing fast enough, so it might be good to switch to the contact beam. Is that the contact beam? Yep. Point at him. Make some space, point at him, charge up. Okay. Might also be good to kill that thing. Fuck, I don't know how to use it. Do you want me to show you? Give me one second. Can I, mean, I pause this game? At any time. There you go. Oh. That makes some space, oh. doesn't it? Ugh. Fuck me. Oh, you fucker. All right, your turn. Okay, contact beam. You oh, wow, they're both getting me. Look at that. Contact beam, you point and charge up, right? Yeah. It's just such a small space that I don't I don't feel like I don't have time. Like, it's not the move. Yeah. But it's a lot of damage. Oh, wow. This recording's two hours. Yeah, we've been recording for two hours. Have fun with that editing. Uh, I'm gonna at least going to have to chop this into three. Excuse Where me. is big guy at? Found Incoming. Him. Fuck you. So Isaac will stop if you interrupt his thing. Oh, fat guy. I wonder if they just keep coming. Nice. So the, the charge isn't huge. Can you blast the floor? Uh, yeah, I'll show you. How do you do it again? Aim and RB. See? Hard knockdown. And then that makes a lot of space, so you can deal with it. Nice. It also deals damage and softens them up, making them easier to kill and cut. Okay, I feel like more of these guys have regenerated. Someone keeps shutting down the door protocol. Oh, it's just a straight up fight. Okay, so you're supposed to wait it out. Weird. Do you want me to kill you? Uh, no. Okay. Here, I can take it from here. <laughs> We're just trying to pass it off. Um. 
thank you, Alfred, for making it to where this LP doesn't drag and drag and drag. I try. So if you notice that this is actually the old node door, and now new things have opened up. I probably just shouldn't be lollygagging in here, huh? He can't get in here. It's fine. You. So something we've talked about. Sarah's definitely going to play Dead Space 2. And I will say, Dead Space 2 actually has some better controls. Um, so contact beam ammo is light. Which is to say, you don't get a lot of it. It's now probably your rarest ammo drop. Sure thing. Um, but as you can see, it blasted a regenerator. And he had to work on just getting his legs back for like 30 seconds before he could even get close to you. Is he following me? I don't think so. There's no music. But down this hallway, something might grab you, so. Just in case. Be Fill careful time, hurry. about overusing that. What do you mean? Oh, shoot it at that. That's a man. Like, that yell, that's not a monster yell. That is a, that's a dude. That's that sound that one guy uh, made when he was buried. His friends uh, tricked him into thinking he was buried. Oh, yeah, yeah. Kiyu. Uh, oh, just I didn't this get prank. All that I money. Hmm? I didn't get all that money I left behind. I grabbed some of it. Oh, thank you. Uh, just a prank I heard about where this guy has claustrophobia, so they fucking got a coffin and pulled the top off and just put it on top of him. Cruel. Yeah. Really fucking cruel. Oh, I can't. I'm hallucinating. Got it. Am I? Is this a person? Hold on, look at the corpse on the floor. Look at her face. Is this the same person? Yeah, it looks like the same person. Same clothes, at least. Same hairstyle, I think. Okay, this is... I'm trying to put her back into bed. It looks like she's stuck, dear. Okay, well... You're also desecrating the dead anyway. Oh my god. Money, though. Yeah, money. <laughs> I'm sorry for your loss. What loss? Of life. I'll grant you that. Man, what the fuck? Look at these beds. Holy shit. Oh god, it looks like somebody melted. Maybe. It's just a skin sack, yeah. Yeah, it looks like... You know the tissue you have over your brain like it's eluding me right now but that's what it looks like there's a there's like a sheath around your brain oh um i mean when you say sheath in the context of you brain, think of I, myelin sheath yeah I, I was gonna say i think of like an axon or something um you why do you keep doing that he scared me they are creepy sorry that is all shiny uh, x ray people. I love this Resident Evil shit, by the way. Mm -hmm. I love weird science. It's a good movie, too. Um, and a good, I want to say Danny Elfman song, I think. What was I going to say to you? I Talking about weird science? Do, 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 do. Dr. Chalice Massa. The specimen continues to respond well to my experiments. It's so there are fortitude. Not to mention elasticity is remarkable. Dr. Khan, I'm sure, would disapprove. But I do not anticipate that issue as the good doctor is busying himself with what the What dialect is this? As if that no idea. Now. He has also succumbed to the same dementia that afflicted the colony. Only Those are heads. He mm -hmm. He had spoken to his wife. But Amelia Khan has been dead for some years. Do they just make sure to bring everyone who is either religious nuts... Trauma survivors are both. Your time is soon. Very soon. So I'm going to run out of limb here and say you probably have to breathe carefully. And you did get a couple of air tanks just now. Um. I want to say they always. This has gone far enough. Accept your part in the God's plan. 
Okay. Yeah, there you go. Isaac, he's decompressed the entire deck, and I'm being locked out of those systems. All the air has been vented in space. You should be able to bring it back on Miss, can I know where to go while you're. Um, I love. Wait, there's line racks. Don't they? Left. Here? Um, is that a baby? Just a head. Baby doll, in fact. No. Oh, God, it's a fetus. You're right. That's... That's probably the rawest thing. Wait, down at the end there is an oxygen refill if you want it. Cool. There's two huh. of them? Twins? I don't. Did I do it? There you go. Cool. Back up to 90 seconds. Um. Oh, Ripper, Ripper. <gasps> Which one's the Ripper? Left. All right. There you, yeah. So those guys were responsible for your first death in this game. Two Ripper Blades. Um, I was going to say, I really like that that weird science shit where they just have like, DNA all over it. Like, like, uh, like, it feels like what they're trying to do is saying, oh, we're looking at your DNA, you know, and we're <laughs> going in. And it's like, no, <laughs> you know, it's it, if that if you see that in a real lab, it is purely like a design thing, you know? Yeah. It, it has no functional purpose other than to be fancy. Okay, careful. The big show's coming at you. Well, this fuck. Big show. No, no. Where do I go? Where that I... way. This way? Yeah. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Oh, I tried so hard. To, I was trying so hard to to, to 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 med pack. Yes, you might need to make space. <sighs> I tried. No, I mean shoot him. Oh. To slow him down. It's so hard in this game when you're depending on hearing to just have it. That's probably why they do it, you know? Dead Space is pretty good about like being like, oh, you like this? We're going to take it away. Deal. Ugh, all the way here. You can just hit B. There you go. You gonna, you want me to pass it? Nah, let me try. Let me give it one more honest try if that's okay. Okay. Mm. Who, yeah, this is what that shit I'm talking about. Like... You watch these things and you think like, like in CIS and like all that stuff, you're like, ah, oh, yes, these small machines can definitely look down into my DNA and see the exact helix. And it's like, even the you machines- You can't save in cutscenes. Even the machines that are- I just want to run. he's decompressed the entire deck and I'm being locked out of those systems. All the air has been vented in space. You should be able to bring it back online from the Even if the machine is de designed for that, it looks like crap. And the only reason you can make it look good is if you, um, you know, fix it up. Stand by. It's probably because you're in a vacuum. So what I'm hearing is, is that it's not worth it to wait to that for that cutscene, and you might just want to book it. <laughs> Did you mean to stick yourself to the door as it was closing so you... Waited as long as you could to Can move Can someone through. tell me the story? Wait. Okay, yeah. Could someone tell me the story behind that? I think that has to be dementia. There's no way that somebody could survive that long without weapons on here. You can move and check No, your I'm talking status. about the two ladies. Yeah, I think that's a dementia thing. <laughs> what? They were moving the stuff around them. It was kind of cute. Yeah. Back out. Oh, there's one of me. There's one of them. Press the button. There you go. Oh, I don't have any heal? 
I guess not. You want to give it a shot? The, this fight? Yeah. Thank you. You can tell I'm getting dehydrated. It's not a sweaty. Uh, I can, in fact. There was one time I was playing Dark Souls, and I was getting so frustrated. And I say, okay, Alfred, can we just watch some YouTube? And he, he, I give him the controller so he could take over while I calm down. And he's like, Sarah, you're dehydrated. Let me get you some water. And I was like, what? And I was like, oh, I am kind of thirsty. How'd you know? And he's like, the controller's not sweaty. And I was like, god damn it. <laughs> Yeah, so oh, those on. guys can sometimes be full of guys. This is faster. I don't know that it is, but I'm going to see if it's faster. This is a hard sequence. Well, it didn't put me at the cutscene or the thing. The fuck is that? Yeah, you're hearing like monsters. But there were none. Yeah, it's so weird. The way that this space lady says noin is really I was, getting on my did fucking I, Did I say that? Did you read my mind? You didn't say it out loud. I was, I was at a thing and I was like, noin seven. No. Was that fetus moving? I swear to God, that fetus looked like it was moving. Maybe it's just a dementia thing. Hashtag dementia, you wouldn't get it. My ears hurt. You should be able to bring it back online from the security station, but you don't have much time. Fear your god. God, these things are such a fucking pain in the ass. They're kind of cute. They're literally flaps of skin. Do you know what they, you know Flubber with Robin Williams? Go on. Have you, do you know it? Yes, I know it, go on. They kind of remind me of Flubber. <sighs> is that what it says, Flubber? Maybe it's something else, maybe another silly word. A different science fiction movie with Robin Williams well, where no, he makes no, anthropomorphic no, no. Maybe, sapien I don't, slime? I don't think Flubber is the name of it. I think it's some other like silly word. I think it's Flubber. Is it Flubber? How many fucking movies has he been in? A lot. I mean, yeah, bad bad question, actually. But how many is he playing a goofy, like, scientist-man? There we go. Now I'm taking care of business. At least one. Oh, yeah, get him. Oh, he's politely stopped for you. <laughs> I missed? That was that crap. You might want to change. Change what? Uh, your air. Your, your. I've got 30 seconds left. He's struggling. Yeah, but I don't know why. Oh, you're hurt. Should I use this? Yeah. Alright, he's doing better now. Oh, come on, man. No, 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 not the babies. Ugh. It looks like he doesn't want to come in here. That's nice. It is. Make sure you get all the babies. 
Pardon me, sir. La da da. Isn't that theme of racism? Is it? I mean, it's the Kirby Enthusiasm theme. I think some of the jokes in Kirby Enthusiasm are that something racist happened. Like Kirby or blank. Yeah. <gasps> Monster. Oh, he's struggling. Do we have more air? I hope so. There you go. Slam dunk. All right, might want to save. It's on standby in the... What are you going to do? Do it fast. Can I be breathing? You're cutting out, Hammond. I'm going to try to switch over. I've, I've, I've grown attached to these two knuckleheads. These two idiots who can't do shit for fuck. My incapable children. Alright, there you go. That's now two... Have I helped you twice? Yeah, uh, yeah, at least. Well, like, physically done it. Uh... Twice. Oh, sell. Thank you. I think we got a semiconductor. Boop, 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 boop. Force energy. Two semiconductors. Oh my god, so many line racks. Uh, Put another stack of ripper blades in there. And we can grab two of these boys if you like. Yes, please. I got nods. Buying nodes is so satisfying and good. And please. then from there, I think we should probably stop buying nodes for a little bit. Send me nods. What are you doing? What? Nothing. Maniac. I'm giving facial commentary. Here's mine. <laughs> hey, I bet you can't uh, put your eyes up and stick your tongue out at the same time. You know, I bet I could just chew a piece of your ear right off. No! Oh, right. Yes. <laughs> Please, not for a seventh time. <laughs> it was only the one! Can I go through? I've got more intel on the atmosphere. I guess that was just a one-er. Weird. We need to get that wolf a bat. What a jackass. <gasps> no, 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 no. Just smash the button. Get out of here. You don't belong. Nope. <gasps> get him, get him, get him, get him. Make sure you got them all. <laughs> Don't panic, they're just little guys. They're just little boys. Alright, see if you can upgrade anything. Uh, I got everything out of here, right? Yeah. Okay. Twice over now. I mentioned because it actually refilled. Uh, the plasma cutter and... I'm gonna get some... Sure. The plasma cutter and um, Ripper are both missing some stuff, as is the contact beam, if you want to put some points into capacity. Capacity? Uh, hold on. Let's look at the contact beam. Can I, can I make it quicker? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I think so. No, not in this game. Oh, yeah, you can. The charge. Okay, sure. This is ass. It's two bad ones at first, but it's a good weapon overall. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, you could sink three in, and then you'd have enough to... What is this? Kinesis. I know, but what is ring? Range. Bom, bom. What do these strange runes mean? <laughs> what could they mean? Oh, what 
do I want? The plasma cutter has a lot of stuff on it. I want more. Okay. Reload. Capacity. What's the Ripper look like? Hmm, that should be good. You can put another two in here and then we'll get the dud one later. Or we'll get the real one later. Yeah. Uh, you just got air though. Yeah, that's what I want. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, I wanted... We'll just need two to get air, or uh, HP. Yeah, I just wanted, um... We're doing a lot of air sequences, and, like, they might be over now, but... Just in case, you know? Yeah. It's also so satisfying to fill it up, ain't it? Yeah, to complete hey, something, speaking it looks about good. filling up. Yeah? Yeah. Nice. So, I think they changed that in two. Instead of upgrading HP, they you upgrade armor. So that you, I think you always have four on the, uh, you killed them the first time you came through. You always have, like, four pegs on the health bar. But the amount at which each decreases every time you get hit stays low. Um, I think so. One thing that I really like about Dead Space is that you can do stuff like every time. Every time? Every time. You can do stuff like compare the, you know. Wasn't you know, that you, from, sorry, go ahead. You can say that everything is the pistol and the shotgun and the rocket launcher and the magnum and whatever. But one thing that is really cool about Dead Space is that every weapon is like a real original new thing, you know? Did, every time. Did these guys just like leave? They're like, well, we scared him. My job's done. Um, because I'm back here and obviously there's no threat, but so. Uh, isn't that quote from Slowborn, by the way? No, it's from, um, Wooly playing Demon Souls. Every time? Every time. It's about Wooly checking behind, or, uh, Reggie. Wooly telling Reggie to check behind him or check his corners and make sure that shit is dead. Oh, Hammond. Oh, no. I'm beginning to truly admire your spirit. Misplaced as it may be. I think... I think you should see the whole plan. You should not spawn the hive mind's offerings. You deserve to witness that. I like this. I like how shiny that is. What was he gonna do? Hive me or something? <laughs> he's describing uh -huh, uh -huh. He's describing a large <gasps> thing called the hive mind. He's going to attack me with bees. Alien space bees. You can reload the contact beam again. Uh sorry, I am clicking the button to switch. Um how do you pollinate shit in space? Well, I'm going to run out on a limb here and say it might not be that important considering there's no air. I mean, like, on other planets in space, like, do they have things that are synonymous? Because, I mean, bees aren't the only things that, uh, you know, do it, but... Um, you can actually hand pollinate stuff. Yeah. Did the margin she sour? I have always been so terrified of having to strip down to, like... Use a decontam shower? Oh, my God. I'm... <sighs> yeah. Perhaps now you would understand. The work I have done... Well, oh, it's going from headphone to headphone. That's awesome. Good job, guys. It might also be just because you're moving through the room, but still. Good stereo sound, especially in a horror game, is super important. They're done. They're done, Sarah. All right, you might want to look at things. Fuck me. Uh, uh okay. 
before I panic. You're merely postponing the inevitable. All right. So there's a stasis refill in here, meaning that you can keep that thing frozen for a while if you like. What is it? Oh God, Sarah. <laughs> That's not Sarah. it. Sarah, <laughs> aim at him first, and then the stasis button, please. Thank you. Excuse me, friend. All right, what's in here that they want me to do? Hey, okay, they want me to go in here. Sweet Jesus. Money. Got it. Other money. Wait, there's a node on the wall. Where? That, the box that all nodes are in. Every time you picked up a node, it's been yeah! Sarah, stasis doesn't last forever. I know. You can also shoot him more. Sarah, you're leaving the room that you're supposed to be in. You, you. Uh, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, you yeah. had breadcrumbs yeah. tell you where to go, and it was here. Okay, so pro tip. Stop. Stop. Okay. Now, do the, well. What am I supposed to do? I don't know, but it's probably having to do with that big thing right next to you. Oh my god, it's the first boss of RE4. Five. Oh my god. That's, how do you even get him in there? Freeze him and you, you, you stasis him. That's why they give you the stasis. Where's the stasis refill? Back there. Thanks. The more you know. Coming in. Cut limbs off. Uh, okay. Stasis him again. Now go freeze him. Don't stop to loot. I'm trying. You're doing good. That one got out, but that's a small one. That's not the big one. He's in there. I did it. Yep. There's another thing in here. On your. Let's just hope that's the last we see of that thing. Oh, it was just one thing. There's definitely a thing in here still. I don't know. Let's just hope there's Look to your right. You haven't looked over there as much. Oh, hi. You dickhead. Fuckhead. You're good. And the minute you said like, oh, that bo the first boss of RE5, I was like, but the opposite. Yeah, it's a it's a freeze instead of a heat. I wonder if um, that's where RE5 got it from. Because it's fun. It's fun, especially it's, in two-player. It two would player. be very interesting if RE5 stole from Dead Space after Dead Space stole everything from RE4. Sarah, that's the same room again. I know. Okay, cool. I was trying to see if I missed anything. I was like, okay, I'll go to the objective. I was like, wait, what if I miss things? <laughs> okay. And I, I did all that internal dialogue by myself. Sorry. I didn't know if you were just running around. Running. Like, you're like, oh, Panicking. a door. Oh, a door. I just go oh, another door. Oh I'll God. go through that one now. <laughs> oh, a new door. Now I'll go through this one. Okay, can I? No, hold on. Punch? Oh, you can. Cool. Best. That'll come in handy if there's goodies in there, yeah. Um. Okay, got a node. Are these, like, printers? <laughs> <laughs> they kind of just look like printers that they put more techie shit on yeah. top of, yeah. Mm -hmm. Son. Uh oh, we're back here to the tram. I miss her. You know you can trust a brunette. Uh, one of my good friends is named Tram, and uh. It makes you think of Peng. Huh? Well, you said you said uh, uh, that we're back at the tram. Oh. You were pointing at a picture of a woman named Peng. Uh, no, I heard monsters. Okay, new slot. New slot. Lethal 
devotion. Environmental hazard. So N I C O L E. What could it mean? Nicoli. Oh, I want to play more. Keep playing. Really? I'll just cut it up. Okay, cool. Thanks. What do you mean, thank you? Well, I, I, I didn't. You wanna... own this house and this computer. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't want to make it hard on you. Well, the thing is, I have to edit the whole game anyway. So it doesn't really matter how much of it we get done in one. Our company is life itself, everyone. <laughs> so I think this is technically the halfway point of the game coming up. I love this game, guys. Wow. I fucking love this Dead shit. Dead Space is so good. This is great. Thank you so much. For making you play it? Yeah, for getting me onto this. So now that you're two hours into a controller and you've basically played... Almost exactly the same amount of time with a controller that you did a uh, console or a computer. Oh, fuck me. It's just better to shake at this point. Yeah. Um, sorry, but yeah, now that I've played the exact same amount Keyboard, of time. mouse, or controller? Um, personally, I prefer the controller. Sorry, guys. But... Um, you will appreciate keyboard and mouse for... Um, Half-Life? You know what I noticed? Hmm. Um, I kept the sensitivity up. I didn't change it back. Yeah. It's been great. It's uh, it's fine, yeah. Another great day on the Ishimura, guys. In this flesh-caked poop hole. Shit smear all over the... It's just a... Boy. Oh my god. Sticker in there. Yeah, are you thinking about James Sunderland? Yeah. <laughs> I am. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can't see myself. Bad game. Mm. That's what they do, though. They want to put cracks in the mirror so you can't, so that you have an excuse for it. Sarah, what are you doing? Did you just heal? Did I? I think you might have just healed and wasted your medium health back. Should I? You've been the one who is militant about not save scumming to get through this game. Okay. No. What? Sorry, I thought I thought that sound I thought that sound was the sound of me opening the thing, the the little heel sound. Um I was wrong. Sorry, there's a lot of internal processes <laughs> going on right now. Oh, Lord help me. <laughs> Sarah, you're reloaded. Stop. Yes, you reload. You were reloaded three <laughs> checks ago. This is what she does when she plays survival horror games, guys. I got to see this woman play RE8 the day it came out, and she is just as neurotic and crazy. <laughs> With video games. With video games. Well, that's what you got to do in survival horror. I'd, I'd hope I, I wasn't that neurotic and crazy normally. <laughs> Contact energy. But, like, doesn't everyone have that game where they're, like, kind of neurotic? I mean, for you, it's the entire genre. I get kind of weird about RPGs. I hate missing shit. I hate, like, not having the skill checks. <gasps> Tomatoes. Yeah. Wait, can you read that? Uh, here on the Ishimura, we use hydroponic technology and organic plant cloning to grow produce as high quality as that on planet Earth. Our plants are delicate and pH sensitive, so take care where you step and keep clear of contaminants. Visitors should be mindful of violating chemical, vo volatile chemicals and variable gravity. Thank you, Ishimura Farms. Thank you. Yeah. Um, I love the flavor text. But like, um... There's a lot of good in what other was I space. Talking about neurotic and video games. Wasn't planning on it. Okay, look, that's a good thing to hear. I gotta look at it. It's huge. You won't believe it. Shut it 
yourself in food storage. Crew that was on this deck, I think they're what's poisoning the air. They've been transformed. I saw one of them, bloated, swollen. The poison factories. We need to take them out where we can still breathe. Hammond, I thought you were dead. You need to get to cleaner air. You're not going to be able to help Isaac in your condition. Isaac, I'm scanning the area now. He's right, there's something really big in food storage. But I can't get a good scan. Monitor readings are off the scale. Be careful. How exactly do these scanners work, Kendra? Well, they scan things. It's probably like a heat. Well, you know why it's called scanners? Money. Why? Um, on the old, like, on the old, old Star Trek, Technobabble makes hick dads fucking flip the TV back to, like, CMT or whatever they want to watch. Can I go to the restroom? Let's take a little break. Yeah, we can take a break. Do you want to just cut the episode here? No. We can just come back and keep recording. Oh, sure. <laughs> do you want to do a sign off? Uh, this has been Sarah. I've been Alfred. And this has been Half Life. Thank you, everyone. No, it hasn't. Wait. <laughs> no, the hell it has not. <laughs> Oh, please cut that out. <laughs> no, that's going in. <laughs> this has been dead space. I'm tired. Sorry. <laughs> uh, have a good day, everyone. Bye.